Hello there Minecrafters, welcome back to another episode of the house tutorials. Today we're doing, we're continuing the typical American style home house tutorial. Now I know it is typical American style, and I know American style houses normally aren't orange, but that's, that's okay. Set, oh sorry, it's time set day. That's okay guys, because we like being odd and still being typical. Let's make sure my brightness is all the way up so you guys can get the best quality. Yes, it is. It is indeed. All right, guys. So that's pretty freaking cool. Now let's get uh, right into the video. So throw away this old one and we'll get uh, a new one. Cool. <coughs> all right. So we got the bookshelf. So where were we? Where did we last leave off? Oh, yeah. That's right. With the jail looking entrance. <laughs> all right. Cool here, guys. So now I'm thinking what we are going to want to do is let me just take a look around the outside of this house real quick. Hey, look, guys, we have a horse. That's pretty freaking cool looking. Awesome, guys. Dope. Dope. All right. So let's go and do the front door. I'm going the front yard. We'll grab it a potion of night vision. Just so that we can see what we are doing when we are doing it. Lingering? No, I need, I need like, I will stay the whole time night vision. Here we go. Eight minutes. Although, what is it only going to last? Oh, hey, it actually lasts for eight. Normally, when I do the eight, it only lasts for six. All right, guys. So... We got this right here so far, so let's walk in. I really like this entrance. It's actually look, it's like so bold and grand, and everything's just open, guys. This is what we love. This is what we love to see here. All right, cool. So now that we got that open and done out of the way, we might actually just get rid of this window right here. I'm not digging it too much, but you know, guys, we never know what we're going to do over here. All right, cool. So we open up, and I think what we're going to do, guys, is start off with our kitchen. We'll start out with that. All right, cool. So. Or maybe we should do the stairs first. We should figure out where we want those. So we'll do this. And alright, so I think we're going to want to put the stairs over here somewhere. The only problem I hate is how uh, this is all one big color. Ugh, guys, it just disgusts me so much. So, yeah, the secret room is definitely going to have to go. You know what? What we could do is we could still put the secret room in this general area. But I think we're just going to go like this here and make like a nice long hallway to the back door Just like so so that this room can still technically go back up in here Don't worry about how we're gonna get there guys. We will figure that out uh, Eventually eventually so cool. So now we walk in and we got this nice wall to work off with and it still looks really good But when you look over here, it'll look a little bit weird. But you know what? That's whatever. It is what it is guys Cool awesome and you can still see into the secret room here, but you're not going to know how to get in there from the outsides Outside, from the outside, guys. Cool. But so now we will figure out the stairs. Uh, I was going to say later, but I guess that we could just do it now. Um, uh, where do we... Nope, not right there. Right here. <clears throat> um, uh... Hmm. No, the whole upstairs area could technically be part of the secret room. This little hidden away room. Can, um, uh... Where do we want to actually put these stairs? You know, guys, we might get rid of this window right here. Well, you know, let's get our glass. Let's put that one back. Let's get rid of this one. Ah, but we have that perfectly. Ah, right, you know, guys, what's we'll right here? All right, so if we want it to be upstairs, we want it to end right there, just like so. Which means it's going to have to. You know, we'll just ladder it off. I think a ladder will just save us space and time. Plus, a ladder we can go like this. Here, and I have to come out one block, just like so. So you come up here, and awesome guys, this is how you will get upstairs into your secret little vault or storage room, or just whatever you want it to be. So now let's get back into the main part of this house, the main area. Oop, see daisies, there we go, cool, awesome. So now what we need to do is, where's the front yard again? So that's the backyard, and this right over here is the front yard. Alright, cool guys, so when you walk right in, we want to start off with our kitchen. We probably in all honesty get rid of that. <clears throat> so we need our cauldron, we need our water bucket. We need our buttons, our item frames. What else do we need, guys? We need a material to be the countertops. I'm thinking we're just going to use spruce wood. So I'm going to type in wood. Spruce wood. Oh, sorry, not spruce wood. Birch wood. Uh, slabs, stairs, and the wood itself. Uh, we're going to need chests as well as signs and stairs. I can type today. We're going to use stone brick stairs. All right, cool, guys. Awesome. So that's freaking great looking. 
So now let's figure out how we're going to do this. We walk in. I think we're going to put the living room over here because it's tremendous. And we might do the kitchen over here. Maybe something over there. But I think we're going to put the kitchen over here. So I think we're going to culture that. Pop out a lever right here, just like so. One time we'll probably ever really be needing a lever. Now we can throw that away. And get our, oh, our pressure plates. We're going to use these ones here. And our trap doors too, guys. Right here, just like so. And right here. So now we're going to want to fill it up with water. This is done. Save ourselves some space. Save it up, 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 just like so. Right, cool. How does this wood look? Um, well, you know what, guys? It's all right. It's not the best. Probably use something else in all honesty, but I like it. I kind of like it. I do. It's all right. Maybe we'll end it off like right there, like so. Uh, yeah, I kind of like that. All right, guys. That looks really cool. Really good looking. <clears throat> all right, so I'm, uh, I do want to put those chests up there just like so and you know what would be cool is if we have a nice really tall a nice really tall cabinet or you know what maybe we won't make it out of chest this time maybe we'll do like like so and we will wrap this part here around we'll bring it around like so I'm not too fond of this part over here but this could be like that maybe put chests chest chest maybe <laughs> we'll figure it out oh we also need our furnaces how could i ever forget about that one the furnace not oh, that's right here is it all right and we'll button these here all up just like so and item frame all the way down put an item for ah dang it guys item frame in an item frame is quite weird cool we're not weird but I don't know why you would ever want to do that. Ah, cool, guys. That's pretty freaking cool. Awesome. Dope. We'll do this. And button up everything else. Button, 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 button. I'm not going to do that one there because that would just make it look a little bit weird. A tad bit weird. Awesome, guys. So that's really cool. I'm digging that a lot. So we'll get rid of what we don't need. And then we'll bring in the stuff that we do need here. And we'll just use our iron. Pressure plates so instead of trap doors. And then we'll go up here and do it too. Awesome guys. Really freaking cool looking. Now shift it in place those there. Shift to click them on. And we'll use the opening trap doors to go down here. So that if you want to cook or bake, you can just open it up and close it. Alright, awesome guys. Cool. So now we can get rid of that. Here, although you know we might probably gonna end up needing those back. So where are they here? It is cool. Now, I do want to put an island in the middle here, like so. So one, two, three, four. But I think I just want to give it like a little bit of taste. Or like, not taste, but like style. Go right here, and we'll upside down. I'm set arrow. I'm a stair one. Let's do that. So we can do that. Cool. And just like so. That just makes it look all the much better. Awesome, guys. Really, uh, really good looking. Cool. I'm liking how this is turning out so far. So we'll just go like that. Do something similar. Sort of like that. You know, maybe we'll put a, a chest underneath the ground in there. In it. Like so. Alright, cool. So now you got like an, a chest underneath it. Awesome, guys. I don't believe you can open up these chests here, right? Nope. <clears throat> Alright, cool. So, um, uh, those are pretty much useless. But we can maybe do up here. We can stack some stuff. Let's go like that. And then maybe like this. And then we can go like that, 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 that. That's pretty freaking cool looking. Awesome. So, you know what? Maybe we're, uh, do we want to get rid of those? Nah. Nope. Yeah, maybe we will. We'll do something a little bit different this time. Maybe we'll go like this. <clears throat> nope. Set. Day. Weather. Clear. Not cleat. Clear. And I'm, uh, you know what, guys? Maybe we'll just leave that spot over there empty. And we're also going to grab another night vision because, uh, right here. Got a splash. Escape. Escape. Bang. <laughs> um, uh, we do need this. I pretty much just threw away everything I need to use. Alright, cool. So we still need to add like a little dining room area. Oh, you know, maybe we'll do it over here. Maybe we won't use these. We'll type in uh, stairs, but you don't want to use stone brick. So that, that, I believe it is what? This one? Two stone bricks. Alright, cool. Although we might actually need the stone bricks. I'm going to do <coughs> um, uh, something like. Alright, so we want to find out where the seats are going to be. 
see it's going to be here and there. And I want the table to at least be too wide, so here and there, I'm thinking. And then we can put one right there, and right there. Although I really don't like seeds up against the wall. That's how it's going to go. And we can grab out our, do we want to use logs? Mm, maybe. Nah, no we don't. No we do not. Maybe we'll use spruce wood. So we'll go like this. And we'll pop out some slabs. Spruce wood slab. And we will just go like this. Just like so. That's beautiful, guys. That's really cool. And we can, uh, thinking, we'll put trap doors on the back of them. But we'll tuck them off with signs. Gives it like that cool little look. Of course, you can't put a trap door on that other back one, which is really going to kill me. But, um, you know, it's, it is whatever. Trap door it. Trap doors. Trap door it. And signs on the other sides of these. All right, cool. So that could be the table for this one here. Now, um, uh, what we are going to do is grab out our lighting, which will be in here. And we'll grab out some fences. I don't know why the old fences are so far away from the other fences, but now we can do that chandelier idea that I was talking about, guys. So I'm thinking that it's too wide yet. No, so it's not going to go good there. Um, uh... Maybe we'll just put it right here. So I think it has to go down like five blocks, which is not how we want it. Hmm. You know, maybe we'll just we'll throw it over there instead, instead of right here. We'll put it over here in the living room area. Now I know. Oh, perfect. We'll go down three, four, five, maybe. You know, we want it to be a little high up. So we'll go like this, like so. We'll make a min miniature chandelier, a mini one. Actually, can we go up? Oh, yeah, we can go up one more. Beautiful. Great. So we don't have to make a mini one. So we'll go like this. Just like so. Hopefully it doesn't touch it over here. Perfect, guys. Awesome. And what we will do is hang these lights. Instead of putting torches on top, we'll hang the lights from the bottom here, just like so. Now we kind of got this good-looking chandelier. That looks awesome, guys. I really do like that. And if you wanted to, you could uh, put that and do it again. Do you want to do that? Yeah, no, screw it. Why not? Let's do it. And upside down right here, like that, and just like that. That is a great looking chandelier, guys. That is so good looking. I really like that idea. If it was such a higher roof, we would totally do it. We might, in all honesty, go change the chandelier of the house all the way over there, that one. But, you know, it is what it is for now, so whatever. Now, cool, so I'm really liking this, um, uh, I was going to say bathroom, this kitchen here. This kitchen area, but we do need to give it some detail so we'll get some of those because poppy shout out to my friend richard um uh some of these daisies some of these babies some of those and where's the flower pots at where are these actually at um uh flower pots gotta be down here somewhere <clears throat> grab a head while we're at it here's the flower pots all right cool guys so let's give this place here some detail i think what we want to do is one two three four no oh, bang bing just like so. And you know, we'll grab some pressure plates too, guys. We're going to want to use golden ones. And they can look like placemats for this table here. This table, this house is coming out really good, guys. Really awesomely amazing. Awesomely delicious. So we can get rid of all these flowers. There were just different ideas. We want to use different ones, but we don't. All right, cool. So now we can grab out some wool. <clears throat> we're going to use red wool. Maybe some orange wool. We're going to grab out our slabs. New recipes unlocked. Really cool. Awesome. So, quartz slabs. And we're going to want to grab out coal. A painting. You guys already know how it goes. Um, uh, what else do we need? Buttons. You know, we'll use trap doors this time. Right here. Just like that. We'll grab some chests. Maybe we definitely need our books. And um, what else? What else? <coughs> Alright, so this is where the secret room is going to be. So, over here... I want to add a bookshelf type of dealio. We're going to make it very uh, movie oriented. I wish you could have a uh, different wood around the bookshelf. That would look pretty freaking cool, guys. I know, honestly, that would be awesome. Nope, we don't want to do it there. So let's grab out our cotta wood, acada wood, and just go like that, just like so. Now we're pretty much done with the bookshelf, so we will save that. And we can could technically figure out the red zone for the secret room now. <coughs> Not exactly too sure what we're going to do for that. Because it is going to be a little bit difficult. We might, in all honesty, just... 
Oh wait, you know what we'll do about the book bookshelves? We will do something like this, this. We'll do a bookshelf type of ah, oh, that looks weird. All right, you know what? We'll go like this, just like so, like this. My chandelier really lights up over here, but there's really no other light over here. So we'll grab another night vision real quick. Eight minutes. Ugh. Eight minutes. And, uh... Alright, so now that we got that done, let's... I'm just taking a look at this here. It looks a little bit weird and odd. Uh, but you know what? It is what it is. What we might do is, in all honesty, just bust that right there, bust that one right there, break it back. Cool. And so now we got, like, a little bit of differential here. Um, uh, do we want to bring it out, actually? That could be pretty cool looking. Alright, like so, like this, maybe? Huh, oh, what do you guys think of that? Kind of like a walk-in library. So, we could do this, and then we can do the redstone, so where... I know it ain't the best hidden thing in, like, area, guys, but... You know, it is what it is for this house style. There's really not a lot of space to be doing this. So, let's just get rid of that. There are these here. There are that. And we'll put these there. So that when we come in... Alright, so over here, we can press a button. I'm thinking right here. That's only going to do the one, is it? Ah, uh, it's going to have to be a lever, ain't it? Our the matey is gonna have to be a lever, a lever. All right, so let's figure this out. If we put a lever right here, it's not gonna do both of them, right? It's just gonna do the one. Oh no, we'll do both. Ah, oh, cool, sweet, awesome. So that's kind of our secret room, guys. Maybe we will uh, change that up a little bit to hide it a little bit more, cause I really didn't want it to look like this cheesy, you know, or whatever. But um, it is what it is for now. So we'll do that. Let's give it a little bit of touch, a little bit of look. All right, cool, guys. Awesome. So now what we'll do is we'll get our couch up in here. Just like so. Right next to our library. Thank you, Jiggy. Here, a little hidden book area. Just like so. And when you do this, you can get... Oops, daisies. That's right. You go up into here. And can we make it multifunction? Oh, we can. Cool. Awesome. So this one here will turn just turn it off, right? Turn them off. Yeah. Alright, great, cool. And then we'll do something in there. Probably like a little secret room, whatever. That'll probably also bring you up us upstairs. We'll bring you upstairs. And uh yeah guys, so we'll do that too as well. So now where I want to where am I going to want to put this TV here? Hmm. We're just gonna ditch the orange idea. Yes, I have to move everything over. It's no CD thing. Alright, cool. So I think we're going to pop the TV down right here. Like so, time set day, weather clear, and we'll do this, and we can actually. I want to do like a gray wall because when you see it from the back of the TV, I want it to look a little bit different. If you guys know what I mean. And then we get so we can do that. Put a slab or something right there. Bang! Looking awesome, guys. Now let's trap door it up. <coughs> Really liking how this house here has such a beautiful open concept. It just looks amazing. Oh, wow, sorry about that, guys. It just looks amazing. Like you walk in from these front doors, these two front doors here. You just walk in and bang! It just looks so awesomely amazing. Really cool. Really grand and looking good looking. I really like that chandelier. Oh, so in love with it. All right, cool guys. So now we got our TV here, our paintings and stuff. I think we're gonna add another little couch, probably right here, just like so. Kind of like one of those recliners that you see almost. That's really cool. It's kind of like tucked away in a little area over here. Separatissimo. So maybe we'll do it like that. You know what? We'll bring in one more. Go like this here. And we will put down some pressure plates. Wooden ones this time. Change up a little bit. Do something a little bit different. All right, cool, guys. I'm really liking that idea right there. That design. <coughs> awesome. That's cool. So now what we are going to do is put those away. And get rid of that painting, too. There's this couch stuff here, and we'll grab out some fences. Fences, I said. 
Okay, just checking to make sure. Why is my skin not here? I don't want to know. Huh. Odd. Weird. Okay. Have I not always had my skin? I know it's in some videos. I don't know what's in this, not in this one. Huh. Alright. Okay. Uh, cool. Whatever, I guess. Alright. So now, I'm, uh, where do I want to put this? Here. Hmm. Hard situation. You know, maybe we'll do it right here. We'll have a mini shelf. Chest holding shelf holder. Just like so. Just like that. That's pretty cool looking, guys. Maybe we'll do the same thing here on the opposite side. Oh, wait. It goes right here. Just like that. Just like so. Just like that. Pretty cool. Awesome looking. Sorry, excuse the language there. Not going to say that. Alright, awesome. That's cool. So, for anyone who did hear that, has heard that. So, now in here, we'll get out item frames. And we'll just bang it. Bang, bang, bang. Dang it. We'll do it like that. One, two, one. Alright, awesome. That's pretty freaking cool. So, now we need eight things to go in there. We got bows, sword. One, two, three. Um, uh, what else will look cool in there? there? Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Maybe a stick. <laughs> and um, uh, you know what? Eight. We go. Well, I think we're gonna do this instead. So here's our eight things. So we'll do one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. You know, just anything really. That looks quite cool, guys. Quite fascinating. And they're grand looking. Pretty good looking. Right, awesome. Now we're going to grab out our wood. This is where the extreme, extreme little detail comes comes in. Well, not really extreme, but you guys get the point. Stare it off here, I'm thinking. And go up like so. And go upside down. Upside up. Upside down. How does that look? Upside down, upside up, upside down. That's quite cool looking. I'm not sure if I'm in love with that though. Maybe we'll just go like that. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Pretty good looking. Another nice grand entrance over here. We'll also grab out some torches here, guys. So we can just light this baby up. Light up this dark, dark house here. We'll put some right here. Oh. I guess right there and right there. Pretty freaking cool looking. Pretty good. Um, uh, Let's type in light. Or not light. Um, uh, well, you know, yeah, we want light blue. All right, cool. So we'll do this here. Oops, daisies. All right, awesome. <coughs> now I think what I want to do is go like this, just like so, right here, just like that, just like so. Kind of gives it. I do want to break that one there. Yeah, kind of gives it a little detail, that, like you're actually inside of a house or like a cottage, little 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 jiggy. But anyways, here guys, we're going to now open up this. I always keep trying to go into that one, and we'll close it just for now so you can see what we're working with here. All right, awesome, and we got our windows everywhere that we look and go. All right, cool. So now down in here, we're gonna want to grab out our wool. Or you know, we'll grab us a chest. In here could be like a little hidden vault area. I'm guessing. We're well, not guessing. I'm assuming that we can. Well, the door's right over there, so we can technically go like this. Just uh, you know, guys, make it all cool looking, and we'll go into the decorations area, and we'll use these here as lights. These end rods. I think they're really cool looking. So we'll do something like that. And plus, it's different. We'll change it up a little bit. Mix it up. So is this night vision worn off? Cool. And we can still see. Perfectly fine. Completely awesome. So we'll do that. And we'll put some more chests over here. Great, guys. So it's pretty much just like a little hidden vault room area. And now up here is the bedroom. So we might do another chandelier right here. Grab our fences. This time, it's not going to be perfectly centered. Time set day, weather clear. Uh, and we are going to maybe we'll pop out a weird looking four by I'm oh, sorry, um two by two type of chandelier. Just like so. And we'll all the way around like this. Makes it look a little bit different if you guys know what I mean. And we'll go up one more too as well. Just like that, like so. And it's a chandelier that's meant for a two by two little area. So, it, oh wait, it's supposed to be hanging up, facing upwards, my bad guys. So like that, nope, not from the ceiling. Like that, like that. 
That looks really cool. And weird at the same time. Quite alienish. Quite funky. To be honest with you guys here. Do something sort of like this. Just like so. Let's see, do we miss any? Do we get them all? I don't think that we missed anything. I think that we got them all. Alright, guys. So look at this weird little chandelier. Maybe it could go up one more block, one block higher, not be as low. But when you come up, I mean, that looks quite cool. And honestly, I kind of like that. But let's grab out ourselves here some trap doors and we'll just hang right here. But we'll leave that open for now. Or, you know, we'll shut it so we can see where we want everything else to go. <clears throat> now we're going to need some stairs. Uh, we'll get cobblestone. We'll get out our wood. And we'll make it so that right here, yes, stairs. We just double up on these stairs. Mm -hmm. Just like so. Make sure you guys uh, comment down below, like, subscribe. Uh, you know, just welcome everybody to the channel. You're all, I just love you guys all so much uh, for all the support. And uh, yeah, guys, we'll just make like a little stair thing right here. We'll grab some torches and we'll tuck them away, hiding them behind these blocks, just like so. So we can light up the rooms a little bit more. And we'll do something like that. I think that looks pretty damn cool, guys. Pretty freaking damn cool. Uh, and we also want to <coughs> just match this to that side there, just like so. And we'll come up to here. Mm -hmm. ah, track lagging. Banging the banging the bang the bang. All right, cool, guys. Do we want to go down one more? Nah, we'll keep it up. By two. Nah, it's just gonna be like that. Alright, cool guys. So now you can go up here and up here will be where the bedroom is. So I think I want the two beds to be like right here just like so. Or you know what? Put them right here by this window. And um uh, we'll get our ourselves here out some chests, some wood, these birch, some buttons, buttons, some item frames. You guys can clearly figure out what we're doing here. Some torches. And maybe a head of some sort in a mini or so. In a minute. So we'll put like a little dresser thingy over here. And we'll mirror it, copy it onto the other side, just like so. Bang, bang. And we will put torches on the floor, right there, and right up in there. Alright, that's really cool looking, guys. Really good looking. And over here, we'll put some chests. Awesome. Now we're done with that area, that spot. Let's work on this. So we need wool. Thinking we use lime green wool. We'll get out a slab. And we'll just build like a little seating area over here. If the window's that way, maybe we'll do like this, just like so. So you can like come sit and look out the window. Thinking maybe we'll do it like this here. Nice, oddly shaped, weird looking couch. Yeah, anyway, guys, I think that's pretty much it for what we're going to be doing up here. I don't want too much up here, you know. I just want like a secret little area. <coughs> you guys can all feel free to um, uh, change it up, do whatever you guys want to or like. Of course, it's not like you have to do this stuff here. Not that night vision is off. Let's see what we're lacking. So we're gonna go into our decorations, some torches, and some of these ender rods. And we're going to see what it looks like if we put ender rods like here, just like here, like so. That doesn't look all too bad, but you know what? I got a great idea. So if we get out a slab, like, um, uh, or you know what? Yeah, we're going to need to use slabs, actually. So we'll get out, like, a birchwood slab. If we go like this, like all of these ones right here. Like, let's say we go like this here, and we, it's, ah, I was going to say, we can put slabs on top of that. That would be really cool. Can we put pressure plates on top of that? Nope. Mm -hmm. I was gonna say maybe we can make like a uh, shelf type of dealio. Something sort of like that. Nah, you know guys, we're just gonna torch it up. So let's grab out our torches here. Bang, bang. Bang, bang. Doosh, 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 doosh. We'll do like that one there. So it kind of just looks like that. House here is coming out really freaking awesome, guys. Really loving it. Bang, bang. And same thing right here. Bang, bang. All right, guys, that's really cool. So now that we're pretty much done with the interior, it's really dark right here. So, you know, we're going to grab out some glowstone. And we're going to grab out some carpet. Look at this. Oops. Blue carpet. I think I want to do, we'll do like this. Maybe we'll make it three. 
Although, we have a double door, it'd be a little bit weird to have a double carpet in there. So we'll go like this. And if you guys can figure out what I'm doing, I'm going to clearly be filling it. Well, not clearly, but eventually be putting this carpet over it, filling up the carpet. So we got like a nice little throw down rug or something, and you can still get all that light in this house without having to overwhelm it with torches, because I really don't like torches, and I hate that we have to have any in here as it is at the moment right now. But you know, guys, I like how the blue contrasts the red, and it just gives it some life. So maybe we'll get some glowstone here. So we'll actually just get rid of these, like so, and we'll bang it out just like this. Now we'll get some carpet, and then we'll put out some red carpet. I think that look pretty, pretty cool right there, guys. Yeah, awesome. Look at that. It's magnif magnificent. Magnificently beautiful, guys. All right, cool. So now let's go outside. Here. <clears throat> and one thing I realized is I didn't really put an exit over here. So we're going to get up some stairs. And we're going to go right here. And we're just going to bust it down, break it down, just like so, and put an exit like that. Cool. All right, guys. So now you can actually get off of the back deck. And what we are going to do is pretty much just detail this house up a little bit more guys so what do we want to do really <clears throat> that's the question here i kind of like this horse so i'm thinking where totem of undying what is this i just can't place it down then maybe no, all right so where was that horse armor diamond horse armor right, i guess i gotta tame the horse first Alright, cool, there we go. Alright, sweet. Shift. Let's give him this right there. And let's get a saddle. Just like so. Alright, that looks really cool, guys. So now we'll grab a lead. We'll grab ourselves some fences. And right over here, well, actually, it's birch fences. Right over here, we're actually going to end up. Hey, get over here. We're going to have a little horse. Stable type of thing, horse poles. So we'll get a skeleton horse, zombie horse, get horse thing, egg, we'll get uh, some armor, we'll get two more saddles, and we'll get ourselves here some golden apples out. Like that. Sweet. Now you go right here. And we want to put that one on that one. I think the gold goes good with that colored horse. Um, uh, kind of already have a black horse, so, sorry horsey, you're gonna have to die. I'm gonna have to kill you. I don't know why I didn't just grab out a diamond sword, but same thing, I guess. Please don't be a black one. Oh, cool. Come here. Love me already. I, I just gave you golden apples. Time set day. Weather clear. Let's just do that, because it's getting quite dark. Alright, cool. So now we will grab a lead and bring you to there. Awesome, man. Cool. So now let's go here. Oh. Let's go here. Shift click all of those and we'll get rid of that. And that is looking pretty damn cool, guys. It's looking freaking awesome and amazing. So we're also going to end up grabbing up some slabs for ourselves here because <clears throat> we aren't no animal abusers. And we're going to go like so, just like so. this you guys can go out as many blocks as you want fences or oak wood fences and to or not oak or birch where is it right here well, I guess we could have just gone up right there cool. all right it's really freaking cool guys looking good now and now all we need is some hay bales did not mean to go to capitals have blocks and we'll get some rails out <clears throat> and we will also get some wood out, not logs, some wood. Alright, I think that's all we need. Um, let me just, I'm just looking. Alright guys, I think that's really it. Alright, cool. So now what we were going to do is we're going to put the little mini hay thing over here. Just like so. And put a detector at the top. And we'll go like this. Just like so. And the detector rail can face any way that you guys want it to. It really does not matter. You don't even have to put it at the top. You can just, you know, like put something else. But I'm going to put it up there. I want it to be facing this way. That way. The other way. Come on. All right, fine. We'll just break those two, connect it, and then put it. 
So we're gonna get some hay. And um uh, yeah, so now over here is where we're going to put some wood like we did the other house. One, two, three, four. Sorry if you guys can hear my phone going off. I apologize. <clears throat> Alright, so do it like so, something just like that. And bang, 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 bang. And we're banging it out. Cool guys, so now we got some wood there. Awesome. Awesome leaf and fabulous. Awesomely delicious. So now we'll um uh, we're gonna put some buttons on the end of these here. So oh, just like so. Just freaking um uh, just give it that good detail. Freaking awesome. Alright, cool guys. So now what we're going to do is go into our redstone, grab out our daylight centers. Ah, it's gonna get on top. What about this slab? Ah oh, man. <coughs> what about these ones over here? Yeah, smoke. Alright, so um uh, what I'm thinking here is that what about over here? Yes. No. Uh, I kinda want to like make this house a little bit Oh wait, you know what we can do? I'm so dumb. Get out our wand here. And we will from here to here. Like that. And we're gonna fill them up with daylight sensors, guys. First solar powered solar panels house in our minecraft world I'll make them blue too if you want to it's whatever you guys want let's see how the blue would look oh yeah the blue would look freaking awesome so let's do that guys um uh, for one of our next videos we might in all honesty i was thinking about building an airplane so like we would you'd be down here you'd look up and it'd be a huge airplane but it looks so tiny because it'd be really high up in the sky so we might do that um uh, we're gonna do the same thing over here Set zero. <clears throat> and just daylight sensors, guys. Because I think this here adds for like a little touch that most of the other houses don't have. It gives it that detail that you really don't see in a lot of houses. Alright, cool, guys. So uh, that's um, uh, freaking awesome. It looks amazing. I don't know if anyone has else has ever done that in Minecraft with the uh, solar panels. I'm sure someone has. Well, yeah, I really like that. I think it looks good, guys. All right, cool. Awesome. So what you could do, in all honesty, now that we have those, uh, let's get our metal wood. Let's get our glass. Let's get out some lamps. Could get rid of these. And we could break right here, just like so, and put lamps. So should technically light those up, should they not? I mean, they should, eventually. Oh, come on, stupid mouse. Sorry about that, guys. Those should eventually be lit up when it is nighttime. I do believe. I think so, anyways. Right, um, uh, so let me get to here. Crack lacking. Oh, so it only... Oh, okay, that's interesting. So it only works if you open it up from the outside first, then close from the inside, which I guess makes sense, because you're not going to be coming in the side of the roof, so... Alright, so I don't think yeah we're gonna grab out some stairs i don't think there's anything on these walls here now are they nope perfect and right here guys we're just gonna go like this like that we'll do it again right here <clears throat> and you know we might do it one more time right here guys cool just gives this little house side of the house here some detail so do it again right here Right here, right here, and right here, I do believe, is where they went. Just like so. I have to fix whatever this trap door thing over here was. Oh, no, we don't. We don't gotta do that. We're pretty good. And I'm just like that, guys. Oh, some daisies. Do the same thing over here. Just like so. Alright, cool, guys. So now our house has some more detail. It's not overly detailed, guys, but it gives it some taste, some texture, some color, dif differential from all the other houses. Now, I really do like this house, guys. It might be my new favorite on this map here, on this world. And, um, uh, yeah, guys, I hope that you will all enjoy it, too, and love it. And that you guys all took the time to build it and make it different yourselves. Now, I did not do... We might get out our stone brick. Just like so. Slash weather clear. Not clerk. Time set day. And what we're going to do, guys, is... We're going to like this. 
We're gonna go like this with this house. All right, cool. So we're gonna grab our grass just because I want it to be grass now and not later. And we're gonna grab a uh, not a fence, a wall. Grab some wool and a sign. <clears throat> and oh, go like that. All right. So what is this? What should we make it cool? Um, what should the name of this road be, guys? Maybe we'll name it Spar Drive. Spar Drive, and we'll put a. That sounds like a cool name, Spar. We'll put like that. Spar Drive, and this way, what will we name this road? Um, uh, Deluxe Nation. Deluxe Nation Road. Enter, and that is going to be just like so. It's this long road right here. Deluxe Nation Road and Spar Drive. All right, guys, so that's pretty freaking cool. Awesome, guys, awesome. So we have a great start to our little little town, little civilization here, guys. I'm really liking how this turned out. We've got two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight houses. I want to put, like, a little something over here, maybe a little something, something over there. I'll uh, decorate it with some trees, guys, and we will see you when it comes time for the next house tutorial. Thank you guys all so much for watching, liking, subscribing, and thank you guys, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.